Cowboy Elvis back here with you, bringing you the unique, forgotten, popular, just cool slices of Americana all across this country. Today, we're here at Washington Lee University, paying our respects to Robert E. Lee, Civil War Confederate General. Let's go take a look. Come on. Robert E. Lee was General of the Confederate Army of Northern Virginia from 1862 to his surrender at Appomattox on April 9th, 1865. After the Civil War, he was president of Washington University from 1865 to his death in 1870. On September 28, 1870, he suffered a stroke and died two weeks later from the effects of pneumonia on October 12th. He is buried at the Lee Memorial Chapel on the grounds of Washington and Lee University. Upon entering the chapel, you'll see the recumbent statue commissioned by his wife of Lee asleep on the battlefield. This is often thought to be his tomb, but it is not. But he's actually buried the rest of his family in the family vault underneath the recumbent statue downstairs. His beloved horse Traveler is buried only feet from him outside. Across from the family vault, you will find an area displaying the actual furniture and items present in General Lee's office at his time of death in 1870. We appreciate you coming out for another episode here with us at the uh, final resting place of General Robert E. Lee, one of the greatest military minds of all time, um, here at the University of Washington Lee at the Lee Chapel. So if you get a chance, come on out and pay your respects. It's uh, definitely uh, an interesting place to uh, see. Well, with that, we thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much. We'll catch you next time.